Uh, Dr. Marshall? Uh, oh, my God. Uh, Are you all right? Hey, oh, you get. Slim. Oh, dear. Oh, I'm fine. Okay, I just worked late. Oh, then I got hungry and I had several meals and lapsed into a food coma. I've had issues with food in the past. I don't know, you know, just with the stress of everything, I just overdid it. But I'm in control. And I don't have to go back to Phoenix. I just, I wanted to, um, come and apologize for yesterday. My, oh. my behavior was just... No, no, no. It was me. <sighs> you finished the tacky on Amplifier! No, no, I mean, yes. I, I don't know, I, I finished building it, yes, but... I didn't have the nerve to test it out. So I thought a trip to Arby's might give me some courage. No dice. Then I hit Popeye's, Del Taco. 14,000 calories later, I found myself down at Subway, powering through a 12-inch veggie on whole wheat, battling to a cut out of Jared. Still didn't give me the strength to turn that thing on. I'm a coward. You are not a coward. You're a visionary. This is probably the greatest work of genius in the last hundred years. Is that a, a chorus line? Uh, it's leftover data from the drive. What, what a piece of crap. <laughs> the machine, I mean. Not a chorus line. I love show tunes. They really tell the story of the human condition. It's a bit gay. It is great. Right. Dr. Marshall, you're going to stop selling yourself short. We're on the verge of major discovery. Now, get up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where are we going? We're going to go and test this little device in the field. You're crazy. I'm not prepared for a field test. No, we're not going to make a big deal out of it. It's just a routine expedition. A routine expedition? Purely routine.